What's up guys, Scott Martin here talking about vibrating jigs, or more commonly known as a chatterbait. You know, there's the original chatterbait, Strike King makes one, and there's a ton of little homemade ones that you'll find at your local tackle shops. A chatterbait's a great bait in the springtime, but I want to give you an advanced tip on chatterbaits and how to pick the right trailer for the type of cover or the depth you're fishing. You know, I fish a 3-H chatterbait most of the time. When I'm fishing in open water, if I'm fishing around a lot of grass, or I'm trying to get my bait down a little bit deeper and slow roll it, I'll fish a single paddle tail bait like this. This is a little bruiser swim bait. I'll bite a little bit off on the head and thread it up on the hook. Imitates a little, little bluegill. That's a nice little one. Or if I'm doing a white, say it's a shad bite, I'll have a white chatter bait with a white swim bait on the back of it. Again, that's what I'm trying to get my bait down a little bit deeper and, uh, and tick that grass. If I'm fishing a chatter bait up around a lot of heavy cover, lay down logs, bushes, lily pads, where I'm trying not to get snagged, I like to put on a double type, double trailer type trailer. Okay, this is a little ultra vibe speed crawl or throw a bruiser crazy crawl. Something with two legs on it that's going to help keel this bait straight so as you come over the logs or around the lily pad stems, it's not going to easily roll over into that stem and get snagged. And so if I want to keep my bait a little higher in the water column, I'll throw the double tail as well. This isn't for open water trying to get it deep. This is for shallow water and heavy cover. Again, deeper water or submerged grass, I like a swim bait tail. So that's what I'm gonna do. So when you're fishing a chatterbait, if you're up shallow, throw a double tail type trailer. If you're out a little bit more open water, throw a single tail. I like 15 to 17 pound line. I like it on my Akuma TCS. This is a 7.3 rod, medium heavy or heavy action, depending on your cover. Give those tips a try. But here's the key, when you're fishing square bill crankbaits, unlike deep diving crankbaits, you wanna fish heavier line. 15 pound test would be left the lightest I like to throw up to 20 like every day.